ANSYS Workbench. So ANSYS is a CAE software which is built and developed by USA based company ANSYS itself. CAE stands for Computer Aided Engineering. You should know about CAD, CAM and CAE. Okay, so uh, in CAE there are mainly two types of the analysis that is FEA and CFD. FEA stands for Finite Element Analysis and CFD stands for Computational Fluid Dynamics. If there is a solid body then you can use uh, FEA or if there is an analysis of fluid flow then you can go to the CFD that is Computational Fluid Dynamics. Okay, here we are going to see about the FEA only. Suppose uh, if you have to calculate the circumference of a circle like this without using formula then you have to divide that circle into number of segments like this and you have to join these points so that you can create a line you can create multiple lines okay now you can measure the distance of a each uh, you can measure the length of each line and uh, multiply with the number of lines so that you can get the circumference of a circle but the answer will be approximate so in uh, ANSYS or in a finite element analysis you will get approximate results only now if you want more accuracy then you can convert that circle into more number of segment like this okay this is how finite element analysis works suppose there is a 3d object uh, you have to divide into number of elements that you have to break it this is called meshing like this okay so this is how finite element analysis works so moving toward uh, ANSYS workbench as we open ANSYS this window will appear okay this is the project area here is the title bar here is the menu bar this is is the menu bar and this one is a standard toolbar this is the standard toolbar this is the project area okay at downside you will get messages and here is the toolbox now toolbox include various systems these are the systems you can select any system that is a analysis system or a single component system okay uh, suppose if we want to add any system to the project then we have to just select it drag and drop in the project window so that system will be added into that project now you can rename it right click delete or you can rename also whatever okay so this is how it works now if you wish to add a single single components that is a, this is a complete system and this system is made up of number of components okay overall six components are there or you can call it as a cell that is a particular cell geometry cell model cell or you can add a single single cells to the project by going into component system you can add it by drag and drop method or else you can add it by double clicking geometry will be added suppose if you want to delete it you can just right click on right click on it and press delete now you can uh, use the same geometry to the particular uh, system also just select it and drag and drop on a particular geometry or a model suppose I select geometry then same geometry will be used for that particular system okay